So those are actually not the shoes I purchased. I, think I paid for the wrong shoes too. Oh my gosh, this. So this is a fail. I don't know, I'm gonna film the rest of this haul. Hello, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So if you saw the title of this video, you know I'm doing another Black Friday haul this year. I did a full vlog of me going to the Cabazon outlets, going shopping, shopping at so many fun at different designer stores, just regular stores. There were so, so many great deals for Black Friday. I know a lot of people are really into the online Black Friday world, but I feel like there's just something about being in person and going shopping and physically holding all your items. It's just so fun for me. So if you want to check out that vlog, I did post that earlier this week, but now I'm going to break down everything I got during that shopping adventure. Also sharing with you guys my savings on all these items because honestly, the savings were incredible highly recommend so without further ado let's get into the haul also disclaimer to family friends watching you might just get your christmas present spoiled from this video so maybe just watch it on mute or something um but anyways diving into my first store is little travis matthew so i feel like travis matthew has just really blown up in the corporate world where well at least at my office where i feel like every guy is wearing a travis matthew polo so i just had to get jake on the trend we got him a travis matthew polo last year so he really loved it wears it all the time decided to get him another one this year so i'll go ahead and pull it out so here is the little polo he does golf so i guess this does have some dual purpose to it where i think he can wear this golfing i'm not really sure about the rules of what you can and can't wear on the golf course but i feel like this is appropriate yeah so it's this fun blue polo shirt i like the style with the dark kind of solid blue and then this like heathered pattern on the bottom it's just really simple really classic and just gonna go with anything and the best part of this whole haul are the savings so this originally retails for 79.95 and i think that's like the actual price sometimes the price marked on here is already like the marked down outlet price but i think that's regular price for travis matthew i'll fact check myself later <laughs> but the sale price this was only 39 dollars so 79 39 i think it was like 50 percent off the whole store so yeah really great savings if you're looking to get someone in your life some travis matthew apparel definitely recommend doing it on black friday and yeah just getting such crazy deals and i will say pro tip i think a lot of these deals do kind of transcend into the whole weekend and a little bit into the week after like cyber monday so you're not too late to get these deals but i definitely jump on them quick but yeah so first item in my black friday haul a little travis matthew polo also if you guys hear like obnoxious chomping in the background that is my dog theo just sitting on the couch eating a bone over there so just kindly kindly ignore that if you can hear it anyways moving right along so i did a lot of shopping for other people but obviously had to you know get a little shopping done for myself so this next item i got from ari 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 i feel like i always say it wrong it's the american i think it's the american eagle like brand anyways <laughs> so i got myself this little oversized like it's not little this very oversized sweater which is so cute it's actually in this kind of like gray dark charcoal gray color it is so soft though like literally feels like a blanket it is so so comfortable i feel like airy and american eagle has so many cute cozy clothes like if you are looking for some athleisure a loungewear 10 out of 10 recommend airy i'm gonna like say it different every time <laughs> airy ari i'm gonna stick with airy definitely check out airy their website also goes on sale quite often so i would say if you're going out of your way to go to the outlet store to get some good deals probably not the best use of your time because their website 
definitely does go on sale very very often and does have quite good sales on their website so just a little another shopping pro tip for you guys definitely definitely look out for those online sale items but we were already out there so we might as well pop in but yeah so this is super cute i feel like this is just perfect to wear around the house where to run errands out and about like literally any occasion is perfect to be comfortable but yeah so i did get this one in i think in a regular small it actually is like pretty oversized like very baggy so if you want something that's a little bit more manageable and fitted i would say maybe go a size down but i just really love that oversized look especially in a jacket like this so i thought the small was perfect for me one for him one for me kind of deal going on here so Second item in my Black Friday haul, a cozy sweater from Ari. Ari. Oh, duh, I forgot to give the best part about the savings on this sweater. So this originally retails for $49.95, about $50, but it was only $25. The whole section was 50% off, so saving 50% on the sweater, making it an incredible deal. Yeah, love this one. All right, and then next up in the haul, we've got a pretty big haul from Lululemon. Yeah, this... This was a heavy one to carry around all day long. Lululemon, I think, was like the second store we went to. So this thing, this thing followed me pretty much all day long. Um, and yeah, there is, there was some weight to it. So I feel like, I feel like I got a workout with this one. I skipped my workout in the morning and this totally covered that. Anyways, <laughs> jumping right into the Lululemon haul here. First up, we've got this little sports bra and this style is so so cute so we have this really cute floral design as the pattern and then the back on this one is so fun it's like all strappy and cute and just a really fun different design i think it's gonna be super cute wearing to my pilates classes that i go to like pretty much every morning at this point in my life um but yeah so i'm definitely gonna get a, a lot of use out of this one and the price on this it is originally 39 dollars which Again, I think is the already marked down outlet price. I feel like regular retail is a little bit more. Marked as $39 at the outlet and then marked down additionally, thanks to Black Friday, to only $19. Yeah, so literally getting a Lululemon sports bra for $19 is like kind of crazy pretty unheard of but yeah so super great steal of a deal there and then I did get some leggings to match obviously gotta get a cute set so here are the leggings that I got and these are the like running leggings they're a little bit more of that thicker performance material I've realized as I've been kind of working out more that the really comfortable soft leggings are not always the best ones to actually work out in if that makes sense so it's kind of nice to have ones that feel a little bit more like performance material a little bit thicker a little bit moisture wicking ish kind of vibe going on so that's why i decided to pick up these leggings and they do match super cute with the top the little purple matches the flowers on there and these leggings retail originally for 168 dollars which is very expensive for a pair of leggings like i'll just address that right up the bat that is very expensive for leggings, but these ones are marked down to, let me consult the receipt on this one, make sure I don't get it wrong. These are marked down to $59, so seriously, so, so much savings. This had leggings there that were literally $9. I think I got those last year. They were a very similar color to what I had last year, but they're this very bright pinky red color. Anyways, yeah, so many great deals. Highly recommend a Lululemon outlet, and there's, even more, even more coming, but yeah. Leggings, $59, steal of a deal. And then I also got this little jacket, and this is so, so stinking cute. It's this little like cropped moment going on. It's actually this thicker material, almost like suede-like, but not actually suede. But it is like a little bit thicker, a little bit heavier of a jacket, which is perfect going into winter time, obviously. It's gonna get cold. So I really like that. I love the collar on it. It's super cute. And just the color in general, like this gray is just a very fun and I think really pretty. This one originally retails 
for $148 and marked down to $59. So, so much to the leggings, also $59. And again, such, such great savings, great deals. Yeah, this jacket is super, super cute. So, love that. And then we we'll just keep on going <laughs> down in here. So, I also got. Okay, so. <laughs> This top actually has a fun story attached to it. So basically my sister Tori, sister-in-law Natalie, and my friend Kaylee were the squad that went Black Friday shopping today. And we all ended up getting this same little cropped jacket from Lululemon. It was just so cute and like everybody tried it on and it was so pretty and just the perfect little cropped athletic jacket that we literally just all had to get it. <laughs> So we all have one of these, which is really fun. Now we have a little memory every time we wear them of our Black Friday shopping adventure this year. Yeah, super cute. I actually did end up getting this in a bigger size than I normally would wear. So this one is actually a size eight. And that's just kind of a testament to the fact that Lululemon clothes is like really small. They run very, very small, especially in like jackets and sports bras. So I would just be aware of that if you are first time looking into the brand or trying to find a gift for somebody. They run small. So yeah, size eight still fit me really well. I know this is supposed to be probably a bit more of like a fitted, fitted jacket. For me, getting it in the size eight, it's a little bit looser, a little bit baggier, but honestly, I feel like I kind of prefer that fit on it. I don't know. I, I kind of like the fact that it's not super skin tight on me. So yeah, I'm really happy with the size eight. And then the price on this one, again, can't be beat. So this was originally $108 and then marked down to... This one was also marked down to $59. So a lot of sections of the store were just like $59, $39, $19. So just you kind of like shopped by just general price. It was really nice. You can just quickly see what everything was going to be. But yeah, so this jacket was $59. So again, a really, really great savings and has a really fun memory attached to it. So highly recommend if you're going to go Black Friday shopping with some friends, you know, get something that you have a little keepsake, a little memory that you all got together. So that was really fun. Actually, last year, me and my friend Kaylee, we went together last year and we also got like matching jackets. So it's kind of becoming a trend. Like if you go Black Friday shopping with me, we're going to get a matching Lululemon jacket. It's just going to happen. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that is that. And then still going strong in the bag. I also got this jacket. So this was one of like the doorbuster deals at the very front. And it's funny because for a while we thought this was a men's jacket and I actually had one for Jake. And then my sister Tori had one for her boyfriend and we were like, oh, they're gonna have like kind of matching jacket. That's fun. But then we realized that it's actually a women's jacket. So we, we put it back for them but then it was just such a great deal that i couldn't pass it up so this is originally how much is this a hundred and ninety eight dollars for this jacket but on sale at the outlet on the black friday price for only thirty nine dollars like actually a no-brainer you you would just be losing money if you didn't buy it. That's, that's the girl math in my head going on right now. So I had to get this jacket. I got it in a size small. And what's cool about this one is it's kind of like oversized utility looking jacket. But it has a snap off feature where you actually can snap off the whole bottom section of it. And it becomes a really cute cropped jacket. So even better, even more of a selling point, it's a two-in-one jacket, originally like $200 on sale for like $40. Yeah, this is probably one of my best steal of a deal kind of purchases. So cute, so fun, and the fact that it's two jackets in one, like literally amazing. But yeah, so super, super cute. And that is kind of the last of things that I got myself. A little lemon. All right, I lied. There's like one more thing that I got myself, but it was just so small that like, eh, it doesn't really matter. Um, so I got this little tank top right here. So this was originally $44, marked down to $29, and then marked down again, I think to like $19. How much is this little turtleneck thing? Yeah, this was marked down actually no, to $16. So $16, and yeah, such, such a great deal cute little tank top. I'm literally gonna wear this all the time. So that rounds out what I got from Lululemon, but 
like I said, don't you worry. I did not forget about Jake. So I got him this little jacket and it's really nice, like quarter zip. Just really classic. Just one of those everyday kind of jackets. You know, just throw it on. He has one in this like maroon color from Lululemon that I think we got last year. I just felt like the black was such a classic color and I feel like he doesn't have a lot in black. So just thought it was cute. Sounds fun. It has like some waffly kind of texture to it if you can see that but yeah just a cute little jacket this one is originally so i think this is already i'm like checking under the price because i have like the real price under here i'll have to like fact check myself but this was marked down to 139 dollars and then marked down additionally to be only 50 dollars so again a really really great deal on this little zip up sweater and just in general, Lululemon had such, such incredible deals. It also had one of the longest lines of the outlet stores, but kind of makes sense because this was literally such, such great savings. Um, but yeah, so Lululemon outlet, 10 out of 10 recommend. Honestly, would be worth making a trip out there just for the Lululemon outlet. Like if you're into the athleisure, athletic clothes, loungewear, this is where it's at, so. 10 out of 10 recommend, but it did probably take up most of our time because Corey and Natalie ended up waiting in line at the beginning when me and Kaylee went to a different store and then we met up with them, but then the line just to purchase these items, the checkout line was honestly ridiculously long, like took almost an hour to check out. Um, but still worth it because all the savings, love it. Anyways, I'm moving along to our next store. We've got all right. So as I'm looking at the bugs we have left we hit up a lot of like workout stores So that's fun. <laughs> Anyways next up. We're gonna do some aloe and I will say the aloe outlet was probably the most underwhelming of all of the outlet stores we went to. They were sold out of pretty much every size for men's especially and I was really looking for something for Jake there I did end up finding something but yeah, the sales were surprisingly good. Like they had some 70% off, some 50% offs, but I felt like they were pretty similar to what their website clearance section was. <laughs> I'm pretty familiar with their clearance section on their website and I kind of recognize some of those pieces in the outlet store. So yeah, I feel like that one probably wasn't the best outlet of them all, but you still got some savings. So just diving right on in. First up, what I got for myself. <laughs> so I just got these little loungy shorts and these are honestly so, so stinking soft. Like they just feel so nice on and I like tried them on. I'm like, okay, I, I have to get these because they are so, so comfortable and they were cute and they fit. So got this for myself and this originally retails for $58, which is kind of steep for <laughs> loungy shorts. Kind of expensive, but we got it on sale. Black Friday sale. Did they print out the receipt? Ah, they did. I'm like, I'm not gonna remember what I saved on this. On sale, these shorts were only $34. So, a little bit of savings there. Still, like, kind of expensive for lounge shorts, but they're aloe, they're, you get the name brand, and they're honestly really, really great quality. So, little aloe shorts, and then the rest of the items I got for Jake. So, every year I actually get him kind of like a fun little workout lounge set kind of thing. So that's what I did at aloe, but I kind of like makeshifted this one, put it together myself, because they didn't have his actual size in both pieces, so just kind of mixed and matched, and I think it turned out really cute. So here is the top on it. It's just kind of like high neck, long sleeve, almost like, like a crew neck jacket. It has little zippers on the side and it's this kind of thinner, like waffly material, which I think is perfect for California winters, especially for Jake, because I feel like he's never cold. Like I'm always cold, but he's never cold. So I think this is perfect. And then the kind of matching set bottoms I got for him are these ones and i feel like the gray in here matches the gray on the top so kind of like a funky matching but i think it looks really cool and these are so soft like i wish they came in my size I mean, they probably do just not at the outlet but these yeah literally 
so cozy, so soft. I know he's going to love them. But yeah, they're super cool. Again, they have this fun little gray little patch on them and their jogger style. So just really, really cool. They have a little zipper in the back and both of these items, let's see. So the pants are originally 178 and I got them for $53. So $178, $53. Really great savings. And then the top originally is $130 and I got that for $65. So just a lot of really, really great savings there. But like I said, the whole experience was a little traumatic because they literally had only extra, extra large in everything aside from these two pieces that I was able to find in his size. Yeah, a little traumatic, didn't love that. And we went there pretty early in the day. I think it was our third stop. So I don't know if they just like sold out of men's medium and everything really quickly, or they just didn't have a lot in inventory, but yeah, so maybe next year. I, mean, I don't know if it'd be worth going earlier because again, the sales weren't as great, I feel like, as Lululemon. They still were pretty good and they have a lot of fun stuff. So it might be worth going earlier just to make sure they don't sell out of sizes. But yeah, a little, a little disappointed with Aloe, but overall, I still found some fun things there. All right, and then the next kind of workout vibe store we got. Fiori and I feel like Fiori is really making a name for themselves kind of edging themselves into that aloe lululemon trifecta now with Fiori in it and I got some things for the rest of my family so I got this fun puffer jacket super super cool I love the color of this it's like this rusty red kind of like that clay color very very cool so i actually like lost the receipt on this one they were gonna email it to me but i never got the email so i did get gift receipts printed out so we're covered there but my original receipt where i see the markdown of the prices i don't have but going based off memory i think this was just 10 percent off and it was originally 158 marked down to 110 and then 10 percent off on top of that so pretty good savings and then I also got these leggings and this is such a pretty color I saw this and was like I have to get this so here are these leggings these are also a gift and they are so so cute so pretty and I love just the branding of Yori where it has like the little patch Kind of just on the back and it's just very minimalist but still stands out i think it's really cute i also want to say we're 10 percent off i think the whole store was like 10 percent off if i remember correctly i'll have to double check i know my sister got a couple of things there too so i'll see what her markdown prices are but these ones were originally 120 dollars marked down to 98 dollars and then marked down again to 47 dollars and I am pretty sure that I got just 10% off. I think maybe my whole purchase, something like that. But already just being marked down to $47, I feel like is such a great deal and such a great price for Viore leggings when they're originally $120. Yeah, so really great savings there. And then I did get myself some things there as well. So I got myself this little sports bra and this one was probably the biggest deal of a deal at Viore. So it's originally $48. $8 and then a mark down to $19 and then another additional 10% off so such a great deal this one is really cute and this one is just a very simple style which I like because I feel like I am working out a lot more so it's kind of nice to have more everyday neutral workout gear where before when I didn't work out as much it was more an occasion if I dressed up cute for a hike or something to take pictures but now I'm like actually working out in these clothes so I don't mind them being a little bit more simple a little bit more neutral and this one does have the removable padding in it which is really nice I really love that and again the branding on the back with the little Fiori tag on it super cute but yeah so that's a little sports bra very good deal and then I did get myself a pair of leggings as well and these are a very dark maroon color which I think is just so so perfect for fall and winter time and yeah I guess honestly all year round but just a really fun pretty color and these ones were actually a little bit less than the others so 
think these ones, yeah, these were marked down to $37. So, all right, my camera like kind of died on me there. So, we're back, we're good. But yeah, like I was saying, I noticed that certain colors and styles of the leggings or shorts or sports bras, like all of them were marked down a little bit differently. So some of them were marked down to 57, 47, 37. I think some of them were even like 24, but yeah, so if you do go to the viewer outlet, I would just be conscious of that. So just because it's a certain style doesn't mean the whole style is gonna be marked down to that price. It seems like it's a little bit more factors at play but yeah these were a super great deal and really really nice quality honestly would make such a great gift i mean i already have a pair of that's going to be a gift so yeah really love your leggings and yeah that's kind of all we got from there and now moving on to some fun designer purchases so next up we've got Miss Kate Spade and I know I've said this before but Kate Spade has such amazing deals and sales pretty much all year round so never ever ever buy Kate Spade full price that is just the rule if you were buying it full price you were doing something wrong but yeah this bag that I got is literally so gorgeous and I'm so so excited to show you guys this actually is going to be a gift but it's kind of funny <laughs> my sister in the store she found these and was like do you love this? Do you like this? It comes in like black or white. Like which one do you like better? And it was just the cutest bag ever. And I wasn't even really looking for anything in there. Just kind of moseying around, just seeing what was what was out and about. And this I did not even see. And it's so stunning. And she was like, you know what? I'm gonna get it for you for your Christmas gift. And that was so so sweet. And I turned around and was like, do you want it too? Do you want me to get you it for your Christmas gift? So she said yes. <laughs> And now we're gonna have matching purses, which is so cute. Yeah, this is literally so stunning. Um, I'll just show you guys. So here, here she is. And this is a little shiny patent leather purse with this fur trim on it. And it's literally so gorgeous. Like absolutely such a stunning, stunning style. It is so pretty and just so chic and elegant and trendy and cute and like all the things. And what makes it even better is that you have these top handles, but you also, the zipper is also really nice too. That was just like a little, little smooth zipping. Um, but you also get this cute canvas strap on it. So I'm going to take out all of the packaging, but this is the little canvas strap that comes with it. So you can wear it shoulder bag, crossbody, you can adjust this strap, and it's just super cute and just gives a lot of variety on how you can wear this bag. Keep the strap off and make it a little bit more formal with the top handles, or you can dress it down, make it more casual with that little strap detail. But either way, just having that option, I think makes the purse like 10 times better. But yeah, this is seriously so, so gorgeous. Such a pretty bag. Like I said, I got it for my sister, but she also got it for me. So I'm getting this bag too, which I'm super excited about. But yeah, so, so pretty. This one originally retails for $399, but then marked down to, let's check the receipts. A super long receipt for literally buying <laughs> one item. Um, yeah, that, <laughs> I mean, like, that's kind of funny, right? Um, it was marked down to $119. So literally over $200 in savings. So incredible. And just the fact that this is such a gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Cherry on top. So yeah, we love that. We love a little sister gift exchange. And then for, for the finale of this haul, I got two items. And funny enough, this was actually the first store that we went to. I knew the line was going to be crazy long. Me and Kaylee waited in it last year and it was an hour, maybe a little bit longer than an hour to get in. And this year we're like, first on the list, we're heading straight to this store and we are getting in first day in the morning and we did. So this is my little Christian Louboutin haul. I actually have two items from this haul. One of them is a gift, but I'll go ahead and show you guys. I don't know what should I do first. Should I do the shoes I got myself or the gifts? I think I'll do the gift first. So here is the bag and 
like I said, we did go to Louboutin first, and for whatever reason, these shoes are like 20 pounds. So, so heavy. Like, have no business being this heavy of a shoe, but for whatever reason, this is literally like the heaviest shoe bag in the world, which was quite unfortunate to be carrying around the mall all day long. At some point, I had like other people carrying the bag for me because I was literally sweating, arms cramping. It was a lot, so carrying this around all day was a labor of love. Um, but I'll go ahead and show you guys these shoes, which are so cool. Go ahead and slide it out of here. Like I said, these are gifts. I kind of don't want to completely unbox them, but they're really, really nice. So I'll just give you guys the breakdown. It looks like the price. These originally retail for $995. Very expensive shoes and marked down to only $322. So, amazing sales, amazing savings. I know $322 shoes sounds kind of crazy as a price point, which I like recognize that it is, but my girl math of rain, I'm like, I saved more money than they cost, so it's basically free, right? Right? Anyways, here is. We're unboxing. Yeep. I'm gonna make sure these are all nice and <laughs> so those are actually not the shoes I purchased. Um, it looks like they put the wrong shoes in the bag and I have no idea if they put the shoes I actually wanted in someone else's bag. Um, they were really great deals so I'm really scared that they're now sold out. Um, so this is like kind of a damper on the day and it says all sales are final. I paid for the wrong shoes too. Oh my gosh, this, so this is a fail. Um, I don't know, I'm gonna film the rest of this haul. Let's pray for me. <laughs> this is going to be really awkward because the only person, I mean I have my videos, maybe that's helpful. Um, the only person that knows I wanted those shoes, like, as a random sales associate. And I don't know if they're going to remember me because it's Black Friday and they have, like, a million people there. But let's try and end this on a high note. <laughs> the shoes that I got myself, which now I'm, like, I'm so scared that these are not going to be the right shoes either. Please. <laughs> Please be the right shoes. Please be the right shoes. Okay. <laughs> I'm like triple checking everything on here. These are the right shoes that I got myself. These are honestly such a stunning heel. I love getting very fun, kind of statement-y, going out, formal kind of shoes. So I think these are perfect. They have these little crystal crisscross design in the front and then on the strap as well. And the heel actually isn't too, too tall in this one. So they're kind of comfortable, like as comfortable as... Louboutin heels can be but yeah really really pretty and these ones were also a really great deal so they originally retail for it looks like about sixteen hundred dollars and then marked down to 966 so still like quite an expensive pair of shoes but honestly so so stunning and really is such a beautiful shoe and Definitely, definitely going to be a huge statement piece, but not something that's too crazy where I can't wear them again. I feel like you can actually get a lot of use out of these shoes. Like I said, heel isn't too tall. It is this like velvety material for most of the shoe, which again, I think makes it a little bit more of a comfortable style. I am wearing this one in a size five and they actually run a little bit small in this style. Normally I'll be like a four and a half or even a four, but this five actually fit, which was a huge thing for me because normally these shoes don't fit me. So 
yeah, definitely, definitely a great savings. Such a stunning shoe. Sorry, I'm so like shooken up by the fact that I have the wrong pair of shoes and I don't know if I'm gonna get my money back for them. Um, and also I don't know if I'll be able to even purchase the ones that I actually want to get him, which were really, really cool, like green corduroy sneakers. Um, but yeah, so a little, little sidetracked with that, but finishing up the haul again on a high note, these heels are so, so stunning. I guess I'll pull out the second one just to make sure I have both of them in here. There they are <laughs> together. Um, but yeah, these are just such stunning, stunning shoes and definitely a showstopper. All right, so that was my full Black Friday haul. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, give it a like, share it with your friends. Also, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite store to Black Friday shop in or if like what store you think has the best deals? Um, I'm curious to hear what you guys think. Also, I will be sure to update you on this a snowballing shoe fiasco that I am now currently dealing with. Anyways, you know, reason for the season, I guess, learning some lessons here. You know, it's not about the gifts that you give. It's all about celebration, spending time with your family, celebrating the birth of Jesus, and that is what Christmas is to me. So even though we got a little damper on the day, just remembering what's important, and hopefully you guys know what's important to you, and then learning what true meaning of Christmas is. Um, but yeah, anyways, on that note, if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe. I really, really appreciate it. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next one. All right, guys, I just have to give a little bit of an update. So the sales associate that helps me with it, he actually runs an Instagram page where he posts all of the deals that were happening at Louboutin, which was kind of like weird at first. I'm like, what are the odds like this guy is like running this Instagram? And when he was helping me out, he's like, hey, you can just follow me on Instagram and like I post all the deals. So if you ever want to just have it ordered to your house, you can just DM me on there. And I was like, oh, like, okay, that's super convenient. So I just remembered right now that um, I have him on Instagram. So I just DM'd him and he, thank God, literally thank God, <laughs> remembered me and said that he is going to swap them out, send me a return label to return these shoes, and like, hopefully all is well. So, just wanted to give a little Christmas miracle update, not in this video on a total damper. Things are looking up. Things are happening fast in like, the past, hour or so but yeah just want to give you guys a little update and i will definitely definitely update you guys when i finally have the shoes in my hands but yeah just positive vibes positive positive things okay that was all <laughs>